Hello my dearlings. So today we're gonna to do a quick walkthrough of the Bone of Castle. So just begin by joining the Bone of Castle. The first quest you just need to kill one guard outside this main gate. Then you just head on through. I'm gonna skip all the cutscenes because I've checked them already once. Alright, kill two guards again. Cool, easy start. Head on through to the next room. Death Knights, you're gonna wanna kill eight of those. You have two rooms of them, so it shouldn't take too long. Alright, there we go, fantastic. You're gonna wanna get free Necro Gems by just killing Fallen Death Knights. Once you've done that, place them on the crowns on top of the statues, and you're done. Up on a petite, you wanna kill the what they call um, undead waiter that's the one I'm looking for so yeah kill six of those and you're all ready to go on walking bread oh for the night folks we're gonna want to go back and kill one night in the previous room and then just click all the food to burn it Oh yeah, it's gonna be a knight as well, not a death knight, so go back to two rooms. Gosh, <laughs> just kill six ghouls, should be good. I didn't get an item drop on each and every kill, so you might have to kill a few more than that, but that shouldn't be too hard. I believe in you, my dear beings. Go done. Go on to kill the butcher. Easy step, just kill him. You're done. Head on through. You're gonna want to kill ten skeletal warriors. And once you're done with that, I will continue on this epic quest. Alright, you're gonna go back one screen, kill one knight to get the screwdriver, and then you just press all the items. Same thing goes here, go back, kill a warrior for a dust drag, and just press all the mirrors. It's as easy as that. Alright, here you're gonna wanna just keep killing enemies in the room until you got every item you need. And you go back one screen to grab the pencil, as I will do in a couple of seconds. Right there on the floor, and just press the DJ, and you're done. All right, for the humorous bones, you just want to kill undeads in this room until you're done. Warden says can take some time to actually finish. I was rather unlucky my first go, but just keep killing undeads in these two rooms, and you'll get the required items rather quickly. Or if you're like me, you'll have to wait 20 minutes. But hey. There we go, all done. <laughs> Time to steal his helmet. <laughs> Get wrecked. Alright, time to head on. Press the trail of yuck. Ooh, like how nice. Teenage Mutant Sewer Turtles, just kill six of them. There we go. The next quest you're gonna wanna grab the weapons of these turtles and just keep killing them in these two rooms until you get every single weapon you need. Alright, let's do this. Poor turtles are dying left and right. Done. Time to go on to the scariest boss of all time, Snuggles. But yeah, just kill him. Alright, all done. Once he's dead, just go on to the next room. 
kill these four knights. They're really easy to kill. So just finish them off. We should be done with that quest as well. This was not. Yeah, we go. All right. Next up is Rottington. Same thing as per usual. Just kill the packs or the mini parts in this case. There we go, once he's dead, just turn in the quest, go to the next room. This one is going to take a bit longer, you just want to stand in the middle of this room and just keep killing these three golden knights. Eventually you'll get all the items. It'll take you around three minutes, depending on how strong you are. Alright. There we go, all done. Next up is... Oh yeah, five knights and warriors. Just stay in this room. Kill five knights and five warriors. It's easy as that. They spawn randomly, so... You're gonna have to kill every single enemy until you get all the required items. Alright, two more. Last one. We're done. Next up is Warden myself, so just finish the boss off and you are all done. If you just die here already, come on, oh, I'm gonna take your sword. There you go, nearly there. Alright, dead. So, yeah, that's pretty much the entirety of the Bone Castle. This is going to be a rather short video. But hopefully my commentary isn't too bad since it's my first time. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.